The Hawks have taken over the investigation into the murder of Western Cape Magistrate Rume van Royen. Police are yet to make any arrests after the woman's family discovered her body at her Musenberg home on Saturday. Nasi Pisame has more from Cape Town. The murder of Cape Town Magistrate Romay van Royen has sent shockwaves through the community of Musenberg. Officers have recovered the 50-year-old's vehicle in Mitchell's Plain. Police Minister Begit Taile on Wednesday visited van Royen's family to convey his condolences. The Hawks have been roped in to probe the murder. It's a, it's a serious concern and that uh, we are killing, as the brother has said, that is nothing but attack to the state itself and the integrity of the state that we have to uh, respond and we see how, we take, how far we take matters uh, to, to, to protect those that are supposed to protect us, including the police. Van Royen started a career as a prosecutor in 1997, working the district, regional and high court. Since October last year, she was permanently appointed as an additional magistrate in the Friedenberg Court. Van Royen's family is demanding justice. This is really acting on our criminal justice system. I mean, she was one of the pillars of the criminal justice system, and I think it's a direct insult to the criminal justice system. And a direct attack? Yes. I remember driving her with my old car to Weinberg Court when she had to do juvenile court. Um, she was even shot in the leg once um, when we came out of court. So she did a lot. She was passionate. She didn't have a family. Um, like uh, she, did, well, she wasn't married. She didn't have children. She lived for the work. She lived for the criminal justice system. So as much as we are saddened for our loss, um, your team has lost one very important, dedicated, committed person. The Justice Ministry says the safety of court officials remain a top priority. So plans going forward, but the reality is that um, as and when there are security issues that comes up, we, we really attend to them and look to them very thoroughly. And it is not unfounded the issues that they are raising that uh, they feel unsafe. Uh, they do raise them with us from time to time, and particularly in some of the areas across uh, Cape Town where there's gangsterism and so forth, and other areas in Johannesburg. Van Royen has been described as a consummate professional. She will be laid to rest next week Saturday. For News from Africa on Channel 405, I'm Nasipis Same in Musenberg.